We're taking the boat to Milos today. It's currently like 6.30. And we're taking the taxi to the port and then taking the ferry. From far away she looks so good. Grew up in the same neighborhood. And that's out of rough salt in the wind. Spend a few hours on the reservoir Never broke a bone, so I'm gonna try hard To prove you wrong That I'm not who I used to be I'm not living at 17 Let's go! She's like a primrose You're never taking me alive So come close And I know why you said it Cause I'm reading every word in your voice Margarine, I got you like egg white and sugar. Protein. Raw egg. Ew. Tastes like what? Tastes like what? Tastes like eggs. Tastes really soft. Really? Our hotel and meals. Combs, and if you're under 25, I think you get a reduced price wow. of the trip.
from the ancient theater, there's actually like this tiny road that you get to walk. Um, it doesn't show on Google map, but there's a bee chasing me. Like, but yeah, this one takes only like 15 minutes to get down apparently. And just now in the theater, all their chairs are made out of like marble. So even it was like so sunny and stuff, but it was really cool to sit on. We're just walking to the fishing village now, Klima. Little peek at the villages, so cute. Guys are so weak. So before we get into the boat tour videos, so I just wanted to share a little bit more about the boat rental experience that I had. There is a lot of um, different boat rental companies in Milos, and some of them don't need any like boat license or experience. However, since I'm still quite young and I've never had any experience like that, they also checked my driver's license, so make sure you bring that along as well. And since we're quite a big group they actually suggested us to like rent two boat instead of one big boat so for one boat we have a actual like a skipper that's what they call it like he'll drive one boat and i'll drive the other but yeah i'm actually really glad that we got the other captain because for some of the spots like some of the really narrow caves there's no way that i can drive in there one of the staff member also gave me like a tiny little boat lesson before we went off and then he actually gave me a little test as well to see if i'm actually like capable of doing it but yeah after that little test we're all good to go so let's row the clips
many people there. We're here at the Parisa beach. On the sand or like rocks. Dinner in Parisa. We got I don't know what alcohol that is. And then bread. And then I don't know what sauce that is. <laughs> Yay, so pretty. It's already the last day of our stay in Santorini. I'm so sad. This is our last hotel. They have a pool and it's really nice. And I think today we're just gonna walk around Parisa, the city or the beach. And just have a really chill day. This is my favorite pastry of Greece. It's vanilla pie and it's really good. Ancient Vera is another tourist spot. But apparently you have to climb all the way up and it's like boiling hot now so we're gonna skip it. Stop for a drink. Pretty view. Good morning, Andy. Jam, cold fire. 